Well, I don't think it's a surprise. You know, I think um, I think he affected so many people in so many different directions. I mean, if you look back at at um, at sort of the the almost lost causes that he's adopted. I mean, everybody gave the fox up for for dead, and everybody gave the city up for dead. And in the time, uh, people walked away from the tigers and walked away from the red wings. And it takes a special person to go in and say, you know what, this is important to me. This is important to the city. This is important to the citizens of the city. And to take all those projects on to make them all roaring successes. I think um, all of us, all of us, are affected by that emotionally and personally. Well, you know, the, if there were two of a kind, you'd be really blessed. But in, in so many ways, he really was. Um, and, in, and it's always fun to, uh, always fun, that's a tough thing to say, but it's, it's, it's interesting to talk to family members who have amazing stories, or even people who work there for 10 or 15 or 20 years who each have an amazing story about how he touched them. And it could have been a quick interaction, or it could have been years and years and years of interaction, but they just all felt different and a little bit special for uh, having a relationship with him. The favorite one I always heard was, you don't mistake kindness for weakness. Uh, and I think a lot of people have said that when we've been down here, but he was an extraordinarily kind and thoughtful person. Uh, but he was strong and determined and and competitive as hell, and that's a wonderful thing. Thank you.